Hello, I'm Francesca and I directed and adapted our Medea, which we first performed in Oxford in 2018 and we are now reviving it. And I'm Shivek and I co-produced the show and designed the makeup. With Medea, we really wanted to create a space for students of colour to come together to create and to explore our own narratives. We could really see the potential there was around us to create something centering ethnically diverse voices and we wanted to take up mainstream space by using the classics to do this. Um, I chose Medea because I have always loved Greek drama and this idea of Greek theatre being the birth of Western theatre as we know it today. Um, it really has shaped so much of what theatre is now and, and what it means and I was really interested in reclaiming this narrative by centering diverse voices. Medea's story was the perfect avenue through which to do this. It's pretty mad when you think that Euripides' Medea was written over 2,500 years ago and it's in pretty much the same shape that we have it today and being able to connect over time like that to a story that still resonates today is, is, is an incredible opportunity and more than that the, the story is still relevant today. Throughout history it's been revived time and time again particularly by marginalised communities to speak out to platform their stories, their issues. And when we put this on two years ago, we took the first step in being part of that powerful narrative. And we hope to um, partake in that powerful narrative again. When I was adapting the script, um, I could see how many parallels could be drawn between Medea and the modern day woman, the immigrant woman, the ethnically diverse woman. Um, it's really a story of otherness, uh, foreignness, alienation, and undeniable strength. Not to mention that it's also a story of love, loss, revenge, and quite a lot of murder, to be honest. It's a pretty great story to put on. It's great fun to put on, and, and we went all out in the first production. We put 15 trees on stage. There was a cage, as you can see, and we subjected the hour, actors to hours of full body makeup before each show. And I was really drawn to this story um, and the Greek theatre format with the chorus that is used throughout the play. Um, it really meant that we could use the choruses to spotlight other art forms such as music, dance, poetry, and really contemporize the script through this device and make it feel fresh and current. So uh, in our 2018 run, we interweaved original spoken word poetry written by the amazing artists that we collaborated with. Um, and we used influences from artists such as Stormzy, Ibei, Kanye to create the musical narrative of the piece as well and we had our incredible chorus on stage who sang these choruses to life um, throughout the show. And we wanted to make the whole production process as creatively free as possible and to include as many creatives of colour as possible. Uh, anyone who wanted to be involved could get involved and we wanted all of our cast and crew to feel like their culture, their stories, what they have to share would be heard in our production. And it was a great mix of things. I mean, the show um, had Bollywood dance, it had makeup inspired by Henna and Art of Ori, which, you know, little shout out to Beyonce and, and Laulu there. And there were also really serious topics broached as well, like the Windrush generation within the powerful uh, spoken words written by our incredibly diverse range of artists. Increasing access to theatre and the creative arts was really important to us through the show. Um, half the people in the show had never even been on stage before. Um, the actors in the choir weren't trained singers or anything. Many of our crew also had never had experience working in theatre. So we really just wanted to give people a shot and we proved that it worked. All that was needed was for us to be given this opportunity and um, for a shared common goal to tell our stories and a love for creating. And that's exactly what we want to do now. We're bringing this show to London and we're making it professional. We're paired with the Arts Council, with Torch, and we're really grateful for the support and our developing partnership with the Cambridge Classics faculty, who are making so much of this possible. Um, and we can't wait to bring this to new audiences and bring those new audiences into theatre and the classics using, using our show.